There we are. We, we were all searching the toy corner to find our favorite toys, weren't we? <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. I found a couple of fishing poles. Yeah, gone fishing right off your dock there, right? Uh, Have absolutely. a little good time out you there. Know, you the can't take these. They're for kids. Oh. Yeah, right. I got a football that lights up also in honor of Star Wars coming out. I got a stormtrooper here that one lucky kid I found a classic, Christmas Mr. Tree. Potato Head. That's great, isn't I it? I looked at this and thought, nothing says Christmas like getting a Mr. Mr. Potato, Potato Head. Every Head. child should have one at some point in their lives. And have fun with it. Just uh, some small sampling of all the toys that have been donated for our 20 Days of Giving campaign going on strong. Toys just piling up everywhere, really. Yeah, I love the idea of people thinking about what local kids would like yeah. and what they could use and what they could enjoy. And fishing poles are certainly among the great gifts that people have donated. Yeah. And of course, there are even more gifts to tell you about. News 2's Rob Fowler, our chief meteorologist <laughs> in West Ashley right now, or at Carpet Baggers, where people have certainly done an amazing job of making sure that kids are happy Christmas Day. Absolutely, Carolyn, Brendan, and Carolyn, catch me dinner tonight uh, while you're there in the toy corner with the uh, with the uh, fishing equipment. But again, we are going to talk about Toys for Tots. Again, the campaign continues. We'll talk to Santa Dean here at uh, Carpet Baggers coming up in a moment. But I got to show you some video. I had a chance to go out to Spay War earlier today, and Spay War, the employees there, the associates, always come through for Toys for Tots, and they donated a lot of toys. In fact, they had a nice uh, display there, presenting those to the assistant coordinator this. Year, Staff Sergeant Golden, and when they counted up the toys, it was close to 1,000 toys donated by the employees at Spay War out there on the Old Navy base and the weapons station. So, thank you very much for your wonderful donation to Spay War each and every year. I think they've been doing this for 20 years, helping us out with Toys for Tots. There they are, Star Wars, the hot characters this year for sure. Here's the way it looks right now. Weather